Here are the additions to our. <laughs> That's cute. The one on the left. So these are the additions to our uh, our home. The one on the left there we named Archie, um, and the one on the right we named Penny Loafers, and uh, uh, obviously the one on the left then is a boy, and the one on the right Penny is is a girl, and their brother and sister, and we got them from uh, the Archbold Farm. No, not the Archbold Farm. The 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 whatever Melissa's last name is, farm. Uh, so this is, uh, uh, yeah, Archie and Penny. And don't mind our hideous carpet. For those who are new, we are renovating our house. This is what it came with. I also used it as a drop sheet when we painted this wall. And, uh, and then this right here, there's a hole because when they put in this knoll post, they cut this rim board here. Oh, uh, Kind of funnily with a with a spade bit. <laughs> Anyways, they go in there and then they they keep going in there and then they they whine because they can't get out for some. Well, I'm sure they can get out, but they just choose not to. So easier just so that they can't go in there to block it and then there's no issues. But they love playing on the stairs and at night uh, they <laughs> at night they run up and down this. Because uh, cats are like semi-nocturnal. I don't know if that's true or not, but it seems like they are. And they'll just run up and down chasing each other. It's kind of cute. Oh, yeah, if you look at his toe there, it got caught in something uh, a while ago. And now it's elongated. At the previous farm. Yeah, at the farm, yeah. By accident. Anyways. They also love playing in all your packing supplies. Oh, yeah. Look at look at that jumbled mess. So remember when I packed those all into nice, uh, what do you call it? Like broken down filings. Well, these are all the new ones that I I didn't do that with yet. But yeah, they love uh, running down here, and then they'll go in there. They'll go into that little tube. They're a little bigger now, so they can't really go in there anymore. But you know, <laughs> they'll go in there, and then they'll jumble around, come back out. Something will crash down. Yeah, run back up. Yeah, you can see. They're a little shy still. So we've been getting them used to us. So, yeah. They're ours, David. Um, we got them for... Uh, so we couldn't get cats when we had Hank. And so, unfortunately, he's passed away now. And so we could get cats. And we want cats for the mice and stuff. Because we've got a lot of mice and voles and other little... Uh, you know, critters running around that are not, they're not terrible. It's not like we have an infestation, but it's good to keep them in check so that we don't have to worry about them uh, making nests in places and, you know, that could be bad for your health and all sorts of other different, you know, maintenance with uh, mice problems and stuff are going to be taken care of by these two. They like going outside, but they just basically just chill on the deck. And then they come back in. And then they come back in. Yeah, we've been leaving the door open so they can go... <laughs> Uh, so they can go in and out, but uh, they basically just chill either on the stairs or underneath this thing here or on the deck. So, yeah. My favorite place to sleep, though, at night is on the Just Joshing with Dakota chair. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> um, yeah, so, yeah. Anyways, I will... Uh, why did you leave, or should I wait for... For comments on this okay so Sherilyn let me uh, let me uh, so I just wanted to show you guys the cats because I know some of you know that we got them if you follow Ashley's Instagram uh, but anyways yeah that's Archie and Penny loafers oh I should have showed you so Penny has white feet and uh, she's all gray basically and she's got white feet and the white feet sort of thing, a lot of people do the thing where they name their cats or dogs Boots or something like that. And so we thought it would be funny to name her Penny Loafers because that's, it's not cute. <laughs> you know, it's kind of like, wait, what? Whereas, like, Boots is kind of cute, you know? So, uh, yeah, Mittens would also be cute. 
but Penny Loafers is not. It's, it's, it's just funny. And I don't know if you noticed, but I like naming our animals funny stuff, like our chickens and stuff. They're all like, most of them are chicken puns. You know, like one of our next ones we'll call like Fry or something. But at first we were thinking not Penny Loafers, but then we named Archie, so we thought. Yeah, we yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're thinking shoes. Un, un seriously, but then I was like, you know what, shoes would be hilarious. Well, actually, I said, no, you said sandals, mm. and then we said shoes, and then I was like, how about penny lovers? Because first we didn't have a name for Archie, but then Ashley liked Archie, and I was like, oh, then penny lovers, because Archie wears penny lovers. So it worked. They're brother and sister, though. Not that, that matters. So we couldn't name them like Betty and Veronica, or uh, Betty or Veronica, because that would be weird. And Archie doesn't have a sister. Does he? No, he doesn't. He's an only child. Okay, so the reason for this video, guys, before we get too far in and people click away, is uh. I took down the lawnmower video because I was annoying myself. Uh, Chanel, I haven't heard that yet. Um, so, we, <coughs> we had this video up for like, I don't know, the night, right? I uploaded it last night at like 11 or so, maybe 10, can't remember. And, uh, it was a fine video, but I kept getting this reoccurring comment, and the comment was, oh, and by the way, I'm doing dishes again. <laughs> by the way, the comment, the comment was, uh, you should put drain holes in the axe box thingy. You know, so, some, some variation of that. And that variation, or that comment, was bugging the crap out of me, because there is holes drilled into the little box thingy, but... I forgot to show them. I do show them when it's being painted, but uh... Hold on a second guys, I'm just gonna load this dishwasher at the same time. I did show it when it was being painted, um, um, because uh... What was that? No way to go, no door. Oh, okay. I did show, I did show it while it was being painted, but it was um, kind of brief, and if you're not paying attention to every detail, it's easy to miss. So, I, I didn't, I didn't put it in the, in the, in the, when I describe all the things I was thinking I would have issues on uh, when it comes to the rain. Now, I filmed that scene a couple times, because the first the first, like when I did it the first time, I was framed awkwardly, so I, I re-filmed it. And then the second time that I filmed it, I I didn't explain that it has uh, holes in it, which is, ah, it's annoying. Because, of course, that's a very good suggestion if it didn't have holes in it, if I was worried about uh, rain collecting in there. But there is holes in it. So, what I've done, is I've refilmed a snippet and I've placed it back into that video. And I understand that the 2200 people who already watched it are probably gonna be like, nah, dude, I'm not watching this again. I'm not watching this again. Just to tell, just to hear you say that there's holes in it. <laughs> so I wanted to make a little uh, game, if you will. For those of you who've already watched it, as a um, incentive to watch it again, okay? <clears throat> Sorry, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm very distracted by the uh, the noises in the background. Do you do you do you hear that? It's adorable. So if I'm if I'm going back and forth here, that's that's why. Just all these noises, all this oh. jumping and bouncing around. So, <laughs> what I've done is I filmed a scene that's going to be very obvious. 
That is not what I'm talking about when it comes to this game. Basically, the game is I've it's in the original video, but I've I've made that I've taken that video down, so you can't watch it anymore. I know so far no one has commented anything about this certain edit, but to <laughs> But to make this game, uh, oh, so to make this game fair, as far as I, I know, everyone has a, a chance to guess this. So, if you've already watched it, watch it. Please watch it again so that I will have the same amount of views, you know. I, don't, I mean, if you don't want to, then don't. But I've put this edit in there that is, I can't say too much about it. It's very particular. Last night I did a Patreon live uh, for the patrons and none of them have guessed it either. And um, not guessed, what's the word? I don't know how to say this without giving it away because I don't want to give it away. The first person <laughs> to guess this very particular edit or whatever will win a prize of sorts, okay? This is my incentive for you to watch it. This is your incentive. This is my, <laughs> how do you say that? This is, hopefully this is an incentive to buy, to watch it again. There we go. I still said that awkwardly bad. Awkwardly bad. That's not a word either. Uh, how do I say it? Okay, while you're watching the video, you have to pay attention to small details. And if you comment that detail, the first person to comment it, or the first few people, because I know people will read the comments and then just say what everyone else is saying, but the first person, or first couple people, if it's within the same range, I will I will send you for free the uh, what I normally send the Patreon uh, Tier 3 patrons every month, which is a print, basically. So next month's print of the month is going to be... Oh, it's to be determined, but you can actually pick any print you want because that's what I do for the patrons as well. But if you guess what the edit is that I'm thinking of, I will send you that. And hopefully that will be a fun uh, game and an incentive to watch it again because I'm gonna lose all those views. Martin farm equipment sticker. No, guessing now doesn't count. You have to guess on the video, but no, that's not it. So that's your only hint. I'm not going to tell you what it is. Even if you guess here, I'm not going to tell you what it is. It's it's easy to miss. So that'll be it. That'll be a, a hint. Very easy to miss. I showed it to Ashley. I was like, Ashley, every once in a while I do this. Or I'll go like, Ashley, is this a clever edit? And I'll show it to her and she'll miss it. And I'm like, ah. So if you guys don't know this about me and my videos, is I started off doing videos because Alex, my friend Alex over at Curiosity Inc, uh, his channel, if you don't follow him, which I know a lot of you do, but if you don't, go check out his channel. Um, but he told me to start doing vlogs because I was doing a, um, uh, like a build video, which is the only type of videos that I really did um, at first. But he said, hey, why don't you do vlogs? Because we I was doing a build video of the Potter's Kitchen. A lot of you saw that video. And then he was like, but you should do vlogs as well because more people will watch and it'll be more fun and whatever, you know? He just he just gave me a bunch of reasons as to why I should do it. And so I decided to do it. And as I've been going or progressing, I've been trying to make the videos more and more um Entertaining, I guess you could say and like Like a Not a game necessarily, but like there's certain things I put Easter eggs in certain videos. I put um, I have a, a Back Not a backstory. What do you call it? Like a like a B story. Oh, that's broken. I Have a B, a B story. Is that what you'd call it in certain videos? I have elements of a of a background story that's uh, been ongoing and I know some people know about it and a lot of most people don't but all those little things I put in there are like it's so fun to me when I see in the comments when someone's hey I noticed the blank and I'm like yes 
One person. I know one person in particular has noticed all of them except for in the last the last installment that I that I put in. What's happening? Bubble wrap. <laughs> uh I haven't had a cat in so long. Um, subtext? Clogs. Ah, oh, clogs, that would've been a funny name. Uh, Josh, I have to ask, when you hop up on the bench to weld, have you ever scorched or caught your shoe on fire? Uh, not on the bench, but just on the floor. I've burnt myself quite a bit uh, by with slag into my shoe, but I wear the Vans slip-ons now. Well, I always have worn those, but uh, I wear those more often now as my walking around shoes, as my everyday don't care what I'm doing in them shoes, and they protect a lot better than the uh, ones with laces. Because the ones with laces, a piece of slag can go in between the laces and through the tongue and then in between your toes, and that is a terrible feeling. <laughs> um, anyway, when it comes to the videos, I really like adding little bits of... I don't know what, how to explain it exactly, but they're basically, a lot of them are Easter eggs or some of them will be just subtle additions. Like even when I like, when Hank was in the videos and I would put like him talking, like I liked putting those. Uh, I didn't do it all the time, but I did it sometimes. Or like when Landon is in a video, my friend Landon, uh, ever since I put his name on it, cause I think in one video, I wanted to be clear on who I was talking about. And that was back when I don't even think I made very good vlogs, but I would I would put like Landon every time he appeared on the screen as kind of a joke. And now I just do it in every video that he's in. I will just, every scene that he's in, I'll just be like, Landon, Landon, right? And that's just a stupid thing that I do. That's just an example. So this game is something like that that we're gonna play when I upload this video. I'm gonna upload it again. Yeah, not Lando, that's a different guy. That's Lance, he's the chicken guy. Landon is a uh, guy from Red Deer. He'll be in the next vlog, actually. Um, uh, oh, I lost my train of thought. Nothing new there. <laughs> I'm gonna change this water. We got a dishwasher now. So now I forgot how to wash dishes. Okay, let me change this one. Sure. Okay. Someone asked if the cats will be just outdoor or if they'll be indoor outdoor. They'll be indoor outdoor. I know some people have issues with people letting their cats outside, which blows my mind. But we live on that. We don't want them to city. Yeah, we don't live in the city. We don't have a, a like a big, heavily trafficked road. We do live in a subdivision, uh, but like there's no, I mean, there is some risk, but there's barely any risk of it getting hit or whatever. There's, there's uh, dogs and stuff that come around every once in a while, but they seem friendly. The neighbor's dog, Armando's dog, they, they, he has cats and he met the cats Seiko, the dog Seiko. Uh, Same met, met Marcy and Penny? Yeah. Oh. And so did Bowser. Oh. And they were fine. Yeah. Um, someone asked if we're going to be getting them fixed. Yeah, we are going to get them fixed. Actually, I have an appointment next Saturday for vaccines and all that. Yeah. Um, another question was... So which video do you want them to watch again? Oh, which video? Okay, so I, okay, I'm gonna recap here and hopefully, I wish I would have explained it better in the beginning. <laughs> and when is the new one being posted? Okay, so it's gonna be the same video. So what I'm doing here is I've made a video, uh, alteration, let's say, to, um, answer uh, a, a common question I got. So I uploaded the lawnmower vlog and on in that vlog, I do things with axes in a box thing. So if you haven't watched it, I don't want to really give it away. But anyway, a suggestion that kept popping up is to drill holes in the 
in the box to help with uh, drainage for when it rains and stuff because I mentioned that my only worry really with it was um, the axes rusting from the rain and that I'd probably remove them when it rains. Um, so drain holes, that seems like a very obvious suggestion and I appreciate it. But the thing is, is that there was holes in there and you can see them if you, if you watch the part where I paint the box. But then I forgot to mention it again. And I think the reason why I forgot to mention it is because I shot the scene where I talk about that concern twice. The first time though, I had the camera like tilted too far down so my, my head wasn't in it really. And so it looked stupid because it was just like from here, <laughs> from here down. So I refilmed it and then I forgot to mention it but I didn't think that I forgot to mention it because I had already said it in the previous clip but I deleted that clip so I didn't, whatever. And I somehow didn't catch it when I, when I was editing it for some reason. Usually I watch the video like two or three times just to make sure I got everything in there and all the edits stay in the right place because so I don't want them to be super long with a bunch of fat and fluff in there. So I'll, I'll try to take as much of that out. So instead of having like a two hour video, it'll be whatever it was, 40 minutes or whatever it was, um, which is already long. So I want, I want people to enjoy watching it, even though it's long, you know what I mean? However, I've made it five seconds longer by filming just this morning. And so you'll hear the wind, like it's a different atmosphere. You'll hear the wind, but I, I show the holes and I just, I just splice it into the video. I took some out and then put some in and then I make it like the way that I'm talking it, it mostly sounds like I'm just saying one sentence and somehow I had two cameras on location. I never have two cameras. So when it looks like I have all these different angles, that's just one camera. Basically, I'm just like, I'm mowing the lawn and I'm like, stop it, run over to the tripod, move it over here. And then sometimes when I have the moving, I'm like, oh, this would be a great, Ashley shot some of that where like it shows whatever. I thought that was a cool edit. Um, that's not the one that you need to guess. But anyways, all of that is part of uh, the thinking or the thinking, whatever. It's part of the production, right? With one camera. Anyway, the, uh, the game that we're going to play for this for this video is basically spot the very specific edit. <laughs> I'm making it sound not fun, but it, hopefully it is fun. The specific edit to win a prize of uh, a free print of the month. So on Patreon, I give away uh, prints to the tier three. I will also give you that same print, unless you want to pick a different one, then I'll give you that print. It's the 11 by 17 prints, right? So there's an edit in this one that was in the original as well. No one has noticed it, which is fine. There's often edits that no one notices. Edit might even be the wrong word for it. I, it's going to be hard to see, but it's not going to be, I don't want it to be so hard that it's whatever. But the first person or the first couple people to guess it, I will send you a print. And hopefully that incentivizes you to watch it again. So if you have already seen it, please watch it again so that I get the same view count. Because I know 2,200 people have already seen it. So, and now it's gone. And now when I upload it again, it'll, it'll be like seven views, you know? <laughs> so, so please watch it again. Even though you already know why I'm re-uploading it, which is to add five seconds of video into it. When are you re-uploading it? So I'm going to re-upload that tonight as long as the internet uh, cooperates. But I'm going to upload it. I might even upload it. Should I do it as a premiere? What do you guys think? Should I do it as a it premiere? It would be more fair if it's a premiere. Yeah, it might be more fair if it's a premiere because then everyone can watch that once. I'll be there. I'll comment with you. Maybe I should do that because then you guys can have a uh, a heads up on when it's when it's coming up. And then yeah, there's this a very specific edit in there that I can't say too much about because then you're gonna guess it too easily and then it's not it's not fun. There's there's a lot of as I've been saying, I'm probably sounding like 
sounding like a broken record here, but there's a lot of edits in a lot of videos that are so easy to miss. And then when people see them, like it makes me so happy because I'm like, yes, it was worth it. Even for that one or two people who saw it. Like, for example, in a different video, Did you see that? Did you see those bubbles? In a different video, we had a, uh, hold on, let me think here. That bubble. In a different video, we had a, uh, what was it? I have an, I have a thought of something, but I don't remember. I had one that I didn't want to give away because it's part of, uh, this ongoing B-roll story, but. Man, I can't think, I'm drawing a blank now. I know there have been been little elements that I put in videos that, that it just, it's hilarious when people notice it. What I'm thinking about is someone's comment, but I don't remember exactly what they said, but I remember replying to it and being like, oh, you saw that, that's hilarious. Hannah wrote you a comment. Hannah, I'll be there to help out. You can message me the answer and I won't mind taking myself out of the running for the win so I can help identify a winner. Okay, well, if it's a premiere, people will be able to guess in the live chat only then. They won't be able to, when it goes into the regular feed, it won't be the same. And I know not everyone watches the live video, so they're gonna, they're gonna be confused and they're just gonna skip it, I bet. So I wonder if I should title it something different. Maybe I should make a community post. I'll make a community post. What's up? People are asking about P9 Shadow and what's happening with them and if they're still here or if they're hanging on. Shadow will probably always stay here because she gave Shadow to us. Because, because Shadow is more... She's way more work. More, more difficult to care for. Yeah. And is here healing because she got uh, neutered. What do you call it? Spade. Spade. She got spade. So she's just been here while she's healing. And then she's going back to Marion. Uh, maybe we see the edits, but don't comment. Maybe, but the, I'll, eh, probably this. I feel, well, I'm. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, but maybe not. This one in particular is like, it's so easy to miss because it's, oh, I know of one. Okay, here's an example of one. Usually when the edits are this like clever, if you will, people will comment. Not every time, maybe people don't. The thing is, is that when people do, it just, it's, it just, it's, it's like a achievement unlocked. Someone, someone got it, whatever. Right? So there is a, a vlog where I'm, I'm talking about something and I think I'm coming from inside the house to outside the house and it was really bright outside. And uh, I had words on the screen. So imagine it said something here, right? So wait, where would you guys see it? From this side or this side? I don't even know. Um, the bright light shining on my white siding of my house as I moved the camera erased the words that were on the screen, okay? And so imagine it said, uh, the grass is always greener on the other side, just for example, because I'm just looking at my neighbor's dandelions over there. Um, <laughs> when I panned the camera so that the words were no longer visible, like they were still there, but you couldn't see them because the whiteness of the letters were the same whiteness as the siding on my house. I hope that makes sense. And then when I, not pan is not the right word, but then when I moved back to where you could see them, say against like the darker siding where the sun wasn't shining on it. So it was a, a, a darker white, is that the right word? Um, those words that were erased by the, or that were exposed to the sun, were gone, but all the other words were still there. And then I remember moving away from the camera, like, so like my black shirt, where you could see the is always greener, right? And then when I moved the camera over here to show that, 
it disappeared as it rolled across my chest and into the white, blinding white light, if you will. So there's an edit that maybe people noticed where like they see like the grass is greener on the on the other side or whatever. And then instead of the grass, it said like SS is always greener and then other and then no side and then all of it got like, it, does that make sense? <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It's a good edit though. And nobody, as far as I know, noticed it. Oh, sorry, kitty. I just stepped on Penny. I didn't. She's very quiet compared to Tina. No clacking nails. Um. Rambling. <laughs> yeah, I can't. I can't explain it very well. I wish I remembered which vlog that was in, so then you could watch it. But this is a similar, but not not similar edit to that that you're going to be watching for when I re-upload this. This is going to be a similar but not similar edit that you'll be watching for when I re-upload the lawnmower edit. I feel like I did a terrible job of explaining it, but hopefully it was good enough that you know. When did you get a cat? Uh, a couple days ago. Right? A couple days ago we got the cat? Yeah. Something like that. If you follow Ashley's Instagram, it was that day, right? No, that was the next day. Okay, that was the day after. Whenever that was. The day before that. Almost done these dishes here. Uh, probably. Alex called me the other day and uh, asked what I was up to and also said, hey, you got two cats instead of just one. And then he's like, yeah, I got this blah, blah, blah. And then he uploaded the video a little bit later and he just asked me some secret stuff. It's not that secret, but I don't know what he's said exactly or what he wants people to know and not know. Like, did he tell anyone about the... Unicorns? So are the dogs interacting with the cats? The dogs don't care about the cats and the cats don't care about the dogs except for when they are like really close when there's some good food nearby then they get a little like they're nervous of each other. Yeah. But other than that they don't care. They all share the same water. They're actually both drinking right now. Both cats. Tina is... Drinking out of the water dish. Tina's on the deck. In the sun. Oh, Tina's on the deck. Yeah. Josh, are you trying to see how long your hair will grow? Either way, it looks no, no, good. No, 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 no. I don't think so. Oh. Yeah, we gotta teach these cats not to go on the counter and table. She <laughs> just jumps right up. Uh, no, I'm not seeing how long it can grow. It just, it just happens to grow on its own. I'm not even trying to, but thank you. Cats will be the boss, lol. Could be, when it comes to a small dog and a cat that's the same size, I can see that being a thing. Sheena's very submissive though. <laughs> what? He's falling and crawling and crawling and crawling. Oh. <laughs> okay. Little claws. Couple more things to wash and then we're done. So, to recap <laughs> and beat a dead horse. What I'm doing is I'm re-uploading the lawnmower vlog. There is an edit in there that is the same. It's in the original as well. I've taken down the original lawnmower vlog because I forgot to put in a scene. Or, uh, uh, basically I forgot to explain that I put green holes in, in the box. But, but people missed where I did show them where I did show them in the, uh, in the paint scene, and uh, I forgot to mention it again when I when I shot the video. Blah blah blah. Okay, 
That is not the edit that will win the prize. And maybe no one will win the prize. But we are going to be doing a premiere re-release of the video with the new edit and the original hidden edit, if you will. And the person who who notices the hidden edit first, or the first couple, if it's you know very close, will win a uh, Patreon print of the month, even if you're not a patron. Okay, so the, the print that the patrons will get next month, you will also get as well. That sounded stupid, but yeah. So we're gonna have uh, the premiere maybe as soon as tomorrow, but I'm not sure. It just depends on how well my internet works to re-upload this video. It took like seven hours yesterday to upload it, and, uh, and now all those views and everything are gone. So to hopefully incentivize you who have already seen it to watch it again, I want to do a little game, find the hidden edit. It's not hidden, but I don't really know how to explain it. There's an edit in there that is a fun edit. It's a silly edit, but it's like a, I don't know. By the way, at the end, at the end of the premiere, I will, in the comments, because I'll be there, I will tell you what the edit was. Or maybe I'll do another live video or something. I don't know. Something like that. I will make sure that everyone gets to know what it is, even if nobody guesses it. When someone guesses it, I'm going to tell Hannah what it is. Uh, so she's going to be there uh, moderating. Or I don't know if you need to moderate on a premiere. I guess, maybe. Anyways, I'm going to tell her what it is so she can't play. But um, everyone else has a chance to win the... Um, the prize, which is basically any 11 by 17 print that you want for free, free shipping, free everything. And it'll be, like I said, the first person or the first few people, I mean, I'll be able to hopefully gauge who is just repeating what other people are saying and, or who is actually guessing, you know, it, it, I think it'll be obvious. And, uh, yeah. Have, has what I've explained in this video made sense? <laughs> uh, can you show us the cats? I actually showed them at the beginning, so you could just watch this video over again, because they're not in the same spot anymore. So just watch from the beginning, and then, then you'll be able to see them. Just saw the cats, and we just had to get a new mower because mice ate the fuel hose. Oh, dang. Yeah, they like the organic materials in, in rubber and uh, uh, electrical and all that stuff. Um, yeah, so the premiere will hopefully be tomorrow, I'm hoping, and please watch it again. What, it's the same video basically with five seconds added for clarification that I did drill holes in the thing. Which by the way guys, it rained last night, I went out there to film, you'll be able to notice that the dirt in there from having the axe in and out, bashing into the trees, the dirt has turned to mud and Oh, the cats are both here. I'm just going to explain this quickly. Uh, the dirt has turned to mud and there's no water in there. So the drain holes are working perfect. I put them like strategically on one end and then it, it's slightly tilted down. So all the water does run to the side. Um, I removed the axes. Uh, I Sorry, I forgot to remove the axes for the rain, but they're not rusty, luckily. But um, anyways, I shot a little five second scene, took some out of the original video, put this in. Now the video I think is two seconds longer than the old one. It's the same thing basically, but with a slightly different scene. And just so you know, the hidden scene is still, <laughs> the hidden scene was in the original video, but I've taken the original video down. So I'm not, I haven't added anything to it. It's not going to be unfair to anyone. I know that some people are probably going to say it is unfair. That's just the nature of doing these types of contests. Um, I get it all the time. Every time I do a, a giveaway or something, I will always get people who say that. Let me just tell you, that is not the intention. I do not care who wins. I just hope that every... I wish... I hope everyone enjoys trying to find the edit. Okay, now let's see these cats one last time before we head off. So, we got 
and we got penny loafers. Now, if let's see, <clears throat> if her oh, I thought she was gonna jump down. She's looking at uh, Archie's tail there. You can see we gave him some fish there. We gave him just the the can, but then uh, they were fi not fighting, but like she was like growling kind of. Can you notice how she has white feet? That's why her name is Penny Loafers. Not that Penny Loafers are white. It's just like, you know, an obvious name would be Boots. Um, but I thought that it would be funnier to name her Shoes. Ashley said Sandals as a joke. And then we settled on Penny Loafers because we're just going to call her Penny for short. And then Archie, that's pretty obvious. Did I say Penny Loafers for short? I meant to say Penny for short. Um... Archie is, is a ginger cat, so, you know, Archie Andrews is, is a ginger. And uh, Archie happens to wear penny loafers, so it's all a thing. Yeah, socks is another thing that people say. Uh, that's a kind of a cute name for dogs and cats that have that. Socks, mittens, boots. I didn't want it to be cute. I wanted it to be funny. So that's kind of how we do it in this household. That's why we named our chickens Nugget and Sunny and Blue, you know. Blue Cheese, I guess, would be the full name. Sunny Side Up, Chicken Nugget, you know, you get it. Plum sauce. What's that? Plum sauce. Oh yeah, and Plum Sauce. We'll probably name one Ranch when we eventually get more chickens. <laughs> I was thinking of another name the other day. Like, we could name one if it was a male, like a rooster. We could name it um, Colonel. Uh, and then there's also um, Lemon, as in Lemon Chicken, who is a rooster. And then if Lola is is a rooster, we're going to call him Roo, after RuPaul, which is not exactly a chicken funny like punny name but it is still punny because he's a roo and roo from like the drag what is it drag queen race or whatever it's called i've never actually seen the show i just i just know who he is and uh and lola our our chicken is a showgirl so you know it just kind of makes makes uh punny sense i don't know if that's right kung pao see kung pao isn't really one that we would use, it's kind of funny, but, you know. <laughs> barbecue? Barbecue? Uh, maybe. Maybe Barbie. We name him Barbie. <laughs> I haven't had a kitten in so long. So growing up, I... Like when I was a kid, like a like a young kid. Hey Tammy, can you stop doing that? That's very uh, whatever you call it. Like I don't know what you're trying to say with all these letters. Um. Oh, that was a troll. Oh, okay. <laughs> um. What was I? Dang it! The trolls win. I can't remember what I was saying. Tammy got a new keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> you said you haven't had a kitten, but you always had kitten. Oh, yeah, yeah. When I was, yeah, we had a kitten when we had Gunther, which you guys haven't met Gunther, but uh, Gunther was a, was a cat that we had from Cadillac, I think. So, we, so you guys remember Dalton, Dilly Dilly Dalton? Uh, he was in my California vlogs. He had a cat that he got from uh oh like in saskatchewan there which not that you guys know what saskatchewan is saskatchewan is a flat piece of land that people go to for some reason anyways uh he picked up a kitten there and we named or he named her cadillac and she was pregnant so obviously was not a kitten didn't know it was pregnant, but dude, the, the thing was so small when we when we drove it home. Anyways, it had kittens when we got like home. It just randomly, I heard all this little meowing, and I'm like, "What the heck is that?" And uh, it was uh, these kittens under my bed. 
I was like, what the heck? Where did these come from? And then I see Cadillac further back. And I was like, what? You were pregnant? That's like one of those, like, there should be a reality TV show around her. Because I was like, what? This doesn't make any sense. I thought you were a kitten. I'm not sure how young cats can have cat have kittens, but that, she seemed way too young. Anyway, Gunther, we, Ashley adopted Gunther from that litter. Yeah, well, long before we were married. And uh, and then we had her when we got Hank. And unfortunately, Hank's prey drive was just way too high. We could not train it out of him. We even brought him to professional training and everything. And it just, it did not work. And he got her. Uh, and then he felt really bad about it. Or at least that's what, I mean, we're anthropomorphizing it, I guess. But it, it seemed like he felt bad because he he was like, licking her and like being all like coy and uh anyways she uh had a collapsed lung so we had to put her down and that is the last kitten that that i i mean i've kind of had Martha said what about Hunter walter walter was actually a the neighbor's neglected cat i hate to say it i mean it depends on how you look at it here it gets down to minus 40 sometimes minus 30 even is is too cold all the cats are getting frostbitten ears. So we, Walter would come over. His name is actually Hunter. And Walter would, or Hunter would come over. He actually came over when Ashley's grandfather died. And Ashley's grandfather's name is Walter. So Ashley's dad started calling the cat Walter as just kind of a, not a joke, but whatever that is, right? And uh, then we started letting him in the shop. And then we eventually, yeah, the, our shop was heated. That was my old my old shop. I had the the one side of it, right? And then eventually uh, we just let him in the house, and then we just had him for a long time. Uh, he stayed away from Hank uh, well enough. Hank did get him twice though, uh, so then he went away, and then he went to another neighbor's house. That's where he is now. He lives. Yeah, and what's his name now? Uh, Roscoe. No. It's like some weird name, right? Some weird actual. Cat yeah, name. I can't remember what they named him. Yeah, so he has a different name now. I actually wanted to go steal him and bring him here, but uh, I'm not going to do that. But every once in a while, I'll see him, and I'll be like, Walter! So that's why, without any context, sometimes he'll be in the vlogs. So if anyone is new and you hear me talk about Walter and show a random gray cat, that's the story of Walter. Four months. Okay, then I guess. But when I was calling around about getting the fix, the vets were saying they won't do any fixing until six months. Okay. So. <laughs> oh, Melissa is on. She loves the names that we picked, Archie and Penny Loafers. <laughs> I deal with feral cats. See, these ones are not feral per se, but they're, while well, they're taming down a bit, but... They were well. The gray one actually was very sweet, but Archie is is not. He's shy. He, he's they very were, shy. They, they weren't super tame. I think they weren't. Yeah, they were a bit wild. Oh yeah. Well, but they're very young, so it, it's not like they had any sort of like <laughs> uh, any sort of aggression ingrained in them just yet. But you see, I just moved slightly, and then he just gets all subdued for a minute. Oh yeah, your mom was allergic, but she wasn't allergic to Gunther or Walter. No, but that was after everything. Oh yeah, okay. When she went through chemo. Through chemo, she all of her allergies went away. It's like thank God for cancer. That's a joke. No one, no one actually <laughs> would be like, you know what? I would trade for allergies, <laughs> cancer. Uh, yeah, but yeah, it's, when she went through her chemo, she. Yeah, she's no longer allergic to cats, but Ashley is allergic mm -hmm. to cats. She gets bad eczema when she pets them, but she can't help it. She just keeps petting them, especially, so Archie is, is like, you know, he's the most, see, look how he's just getting nervous. Ashley just moves over. Um, well, I don't know if he's nervous or just, 
just curious. But anyways, he <laughs> when Ashley can get him purring like a motorboat there, she uh, she just won't stop petting him. And then, you know, because we want him to be to know that, you know, he can trust us or whatever, you know, and that this is his home. Uh, they do go outside, but not not uh, not far. So I'm not sure if they would run away or whatever. I mean, if they do, I mean, that's on them, right? Cats are are a lot more independent than dogs, it seems. Penny is a female, yeah. If they are male, please get them fixed soon so they won't spray in the house. Oh yeah, absolutely. That one is is male. And we will get them fixed. We already have an appointment that's next month. Or wait, what do we have? We, we have a vax appointment next week. Next Saturday they're getting vaccines and then after that they have their... Yeah, next month. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's amazing to me how agile they are. Stephanie's cat's name is Penny as well. Yeah, they are agile. And like, they're... So... They, when they run around, they run through like all these and then they, they mostly spend time running up and down the stairs and like flopping and flipping and stuff. It's hilarious. So when I saw that they need toys, they do have toys. Yeah, they have toys that they don't play with. They don't play with them, they just like entertain themselves. Yeah. And they also, they also, um, like when they're outside, they don't chase things like butterflies and stuff, they just chill on the deck. Melissa says she was petting Archie and I think he was just putting up with me. <laughs> yeah, it could be. This one is easier to pet. This one's super chill. Hey, Archie. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, you like that dish soap smell? Oh, I think he actually does. Yeah, see, he's a little less uh, enthused. <laughs> but he'll follow me around the house, though. Like, when I go, you know, to the room, he'll be right behind me. <laughs> Anyways, guys, this was not supposed to be a cat show and tell video. I feel like uh, very few people are actually gonna gonna watch this, but... Stay tuned for the, uh, I'm going to make a community post, so stay tuned for the, the re-release, extended cut, two seconds longer, but with one different scene of the, uh, of the lawnmower vlog, and look for the, uh, the edit, not the new edit, the edit that was in the original to win a prize. The original has this particular edit that I think is... I don't know if funny is the right word. It's just something that's fun, let's say. And it's it's in the new version as well. It's exactly the same, really. And you can win a 11 by 17 prize. You can only do it on the, uh, there we go. You can only do it on the uh, premiere, though. It won't be in the regular feed. The contest will be over at the end of the premiere. Oh, look at this freaking guy. Let's see if I can pet him. There we go. Let's see if he'll purr. Nope, he's not purring. I uh, seems what? I hear. That was purring. Yeah, I can hear. My, I'm so deaf. It's my tinnitus. I can't hear shit when it comes to. To happiness. <laughs> oh, I can hear it if I turn my head sideways. <laughs> yeah, I can't hear it. That's actually pretty loud. Can you guys hear that? Ashley could hear it from all the way in the kitchen, but I couldn't hear it. Oh, Phil's got tinnitus too. He can hear his ears ringing. That's what happened last night in the Oh, he's going to claw my arm, isn't he? Oh, there, I can hear it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
This is the first time I've been able to do this. Hannah says she's half dead. <laughs> she meant half deaf. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. He's not clawing me. Okay, guys. That's it. That's it. Archie and Penny. Seems like they have longer tails than usual. Really? Yeah. I mean, I could just be me making something up, but it just seems like it. Oh, and by the way, guys, nine more weeks until we can put in our floor if all goes to plan. So thank you guys for buying the, uh, the postcards. That is going to be something since they're so like not useful. What's the word? Popular. <laughs> like they are bought so frequently. We're going to add them to the permanent catalog as a permanent catalog. How do you say that? As a, as something that you can always buy forever. Like we'll always have them available. So thank you very much. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Okay. I'm going to make a community post now before I forget about the new the new thing and it's going to have much clearer instructions. Oh, this is so awesome. He's never let me do this before. Just patience. Patience. He's purring like 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 a Jetsons car. Can I sell them in smaller packs or individuals? No, they're just in packs of seven. So you just buy the the packs of seven for 25 and then, yeah, that's what they are. Just they're individual, they're not individual. How do you say that? They're not sold individually. There we go. It's because he's on TV. Archie is a performer. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, that was a loud one. We had a Maine Coon cat with really long tail. A friend said it had a monkey tail. Maine Coons, that's what my last cat was. They're so big. Which ones are Maine Coons? Those are like those ones that are like long hair and they're really tall. But they got like, like their chest is like two chests high. Oh, was like, that kitty? Yeah, the second kitty, kitty, yeah. Uh -huh. My first cat I had, named we named it Kitty. And then the second cat I had, we named it Kitty. <laughs> Okay, that's it for real now. <laughs> My sister used to have a calico cat that no lie loved being swatted with a fly. Thorn. That's what Cadillac was. She was a calico. <laughs> My uncle had a dog named DOG. <laughs> All right, all right, Archie. Oh. And Penny. That's your nose. <laughs> okay, see me next time.